Okay, let's carry out some crazy experiments. Here yeah, we'll see what happens when sodium metal reacts with watermelon. First, let's open the watermelon. Warning, after this reaction, this watermelon is no longer fit for consumption. Don't try it at home, but if you do, good luck. See you there. Here we go. Accidental explosions we encountered during this experiment though we expected it might happen That's why we are very very careful and you should also be careful You don't like me <laughs> Watch the beautiful moment of the reaction Welcome back. The chemistry behind what we just watched to show that this fruit is called watermelon and that means that what is inside it is water and sodium reacts vigorously with water. So I opened it and allowed the water from the watermelon to touch the sodium metal and that caused that explosive reaction. Thanks for watching. Stay subscribed because we have more scientific tricks for you. But what must you learn from here? That sodium reacts vigorously with cold water and the lecture behind you will see it. how when we test this water remaining here is already sodium hydroxide though you can't see it clearly because it's colored with the, the, the reddish color from the watermelon if you test it with the most pepper it's gonna turn red with most pepper blue to show that the thing remaining here now is sodium hydroxide thanks for watching some majesty easy world science channel how the best for you don't go anywhere science tricks we educate we give you what we want stay subscribed thanks for watching once again Colors of the melon. Okay. That's what's distracting it. So we remove the red color and see. We need to wash it with pure water. You see it. Wow, wait, wait, wait. Come on here. I still reacted so you. You want to kill me? <laughs> no, it's not. Let's try it again. That's it. Uh -huh. After washing it, complete. I'm, I'm converting it. Yeah. Okay. Then. Our parent chain is ETH because it contains two carbon and the functional group there is OH. Then we have ethanoic acid first. So, that carbon number two, you notice there is OH there, and the same carbon number two that is phenyl group.
Sometimes I come across these expressions when I buy my medications. I would like you to help me explain their meanings. Okay, thank you. Okay, the first one is star.